It's the Pigeon Talk Podcast with your host, Yisrael Mayer Merkin and Suki Silver from the RCCS Hockey Classic. Brought to you by OPSEC Consulting. Okay, so we are live here at Captain's Game 2024. Pigeon Talk hits the road. And how apropos for our first interview, the, our first captain is an actual pigeon. Please introduce yourself for all the fans. Who are you? I am Shmuley Weinberg, captain of the Pigeons. Captain of the Brooklyn Pigeons. Okay, Shmuley, so how long have you been the captain in the RCCS tournament? This will be my fourth tournament and fifth year captaining. That's true, right? The, yeah. the, that first year. Okay, now, what do you like most about being captain in the RCCS ter- hockey tournament? Um, gotta love the boys. Love the boys. <laughs> Uh, yeah, raising, raising money for a great organization we, we, we and it. helping push it, helping make sure everyone is uh, doing their utmost and doing as much as they can. Can we get a cuckoo for the guys? Yes. Cuckoo! Wow, that, that, that sounds oh, eerily right. and scarily real. Okay, and now, what is, when you get on the ice, what's your biggest pet peeve on the ice? As a captain, mm-hmm. long shifts. Long shifts. Long shifts. Keep them quick, keep them, keep them short. Amen. All right. Merkin's pet peeve is long shifts with the lull in the fundraiser. Fair enough. Thank you, Seki. All right. Shmuley, we'll see you on the ice. Enjoy tonight. Okay. We are back, and you're not going anywhere. We are. Nope, don't go anywhere. Okay. Did you get in here with me? Okay. We are back here. Captain's Game 2024, pigeon, uh, uh, pigeon Talk on the Road. We are here with, our ne- uh, with another captain who needs no introduction, so I will allow him to introduce himself. Do you know what your name is? Dave Rosenberg. <laughs> David Rosenberg. Okay, now Mr. Ro- you're such a- All right, everyone, this is Akiva Shapiro. Akiva, what is the name of the, ca- of the team that you are a captain of? Guns and Rosenbergs. Guns and Rosenbergs. Now, um, have you always been a captain of Guns and Rosenbergs? Is that a trick question? Yes. 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 No, you haven't. Of course I have. Have you been a captain of another team before Guns N' Rosenbergs? No. Okay, this is just strange. You, were you not a captain last year of the Monstars? Yeah. Yes. Okay, thank you very much. I'm All right. For, I'm trying to forget them. Oh, oh ouch. Okay, Akiva, Akiva he's, he's already up there. Okay, Akiva, so as a captain, what is your biggest pet peeve on the ice? So he's trying to tell you what to say. And this is not working, huh? All right, but better question. What? Hello, get back, get back in the shot. All right, wait. It's guys the size of Reber who don't hit. Ooh, okay, now, what is your favorite part of the RCCS Hockey Classic? Talking to you every day. <laughs> yeah, all right. Okay, now, what is your, well, one last question, because Suki wants to know, what is your favorite piece of swag? Yeah, sublimated jersey. Sublimated jersey. Okay, keep it going. Have a good time. Okay, so our next interview here on Pigeon Talk live on the road at Captain's Game 2024 is Josh Gormley. So, Josh, first of all, what team do you play for? Uh, I play for the Baby Sharks. Did that team used to have a different name? Yes, it used to be Team Dasman. Oh. Run by the famous Michael Katz. (laughs) The famous... So how does it feel not to be getting team incentives now? You know, we don't do this for the team incentives. We do this for RCCS. That's right. That's the only reason why we're here. That, there, see, you know what, by the way, do me a favor, Suki. You know, he, he's going to be here all night. Okay, now, what well, do you... Suki's playing defense for us, so... You know, <laughs> Good like, luck, my friend. to say to him. <laughs> okay, now, you've been playing... How many years have you been in the tournament so far? I think since 2019, so a couple years, six What's your favorite part of the RCCS hockey tournament? Um, I think just getting along with all the guys. Um, you know, we get to gather together once a year, and um, I think everyone just has a good time. And obviously, we do it for the patients, but, you know, playing hockey for two days straight is just like a dream. Awesome. Okay, now I would like to, if, if we can scan up and down on, the, uh, on Josh, because Josh is totally decked in RCCS. Pull down the mask. Oh, that is so imposing. It's awesome. All right. Josh, thank you very, very much. Go enjoy yourself tonight. Think about it. Come on. Man's back. Let's go. (laughs) 
Okay, we're back. We're back with Shlomo Man's back. Shlomo, what is the name of the team that you captain? Team Beitler. Hey, Shlomo, how long have you been playing in the RCS Hockey Classic? I've been here since day one. Day one. Now, what have you? What do you see as the biggest change since day one? Like the evolution of the tournament. What to you is the biggest change? And don't say the amount of white hairs in my beard. I, I, I don't know. I think the amount of money we raise is a good, good, good amount, yeah? Yeah, it's pretty good. There pretty good. it is. Okay, one more. What is your favorite part of this tournament? I hate to uh, you know, say the same answer as Akiva, but it's you know, talking to you every day, being able to uh, give, you, give you a hug. <laughs> yeah. Damn, that's right. Okay, love you, man. Love Go up. Enjoy. Okay, we are back. We are back with someone who definitely needs no introduction. Hold on, hold on. Styre's calling me. Styre's calling <laughs> Oh, look how hurt I am. <laughs> We're even now. That's good. He's good. He's very good. All right. Everybody, this is Nathan Reber. Nathan Reber, which team are you the captain of? They're called the Syrian Chadet. I mean, the, uh, the Brooklyn Outlaws. The, Bro the Brooklyn Outlaws. Okay. What do you like most about being a captain? Uh, I guess pushing around the Syrians a little bit since they're all Syrians on my team. No, I mean, it's getting the guys together, getting the team together, getting pushing them to raise money. It's, it's you know, it's fun. What is your favorite part of this tournament? Uh, favorite part of this tournament? Uh, I think overall, all the tournaments, um, seeing how much money we raise, uh, seeing the tournament grow, going from I think the first year was like eight teams, and now we're up to 26 teams. Seeing how much, how many more people are getting involved and things like that, um, and everybody coming together to kill cancer. I mean, what more could you ask for? I think it's amazing. Nathan, we love you. All right, go enjoy. Yeah. I'll get up here, baby. Oh, right. But we're back. We're continuing these wonderful interviews at Captain's Game 2024. And we have with us Scott Tropper. Scott, please introduce yourself. First of all, which team are you playing for? Uh, Scott Tropper, uh, assistant captain for Cobra Chi. Cobra Chi. Now, did you always play for Cobra, for Cobra Chi? This is our first year. We're a mix of two teams from prior years, and we're looking forward. Amazing. Now, how many, and how many years have you been playing in the RCCS Hockey Classic? Uh, this will be my fourth year. Wow, four, four years. All right, so it's an amazing event. What, do, what is your favorite part of this event? I think it's really just, uh, I mean, number one is the tzedakah and the chesed that we're all doing for the cancer patients and their families. And also just really the rest of it is just hanging out with the boys and just, you know, having a good time on, over the two days. Now, final question. As a captain, you know, trying to get all the guys together, what is your biggest pet peeve on the ice? On the ice? Uh, guys who, uh, who don't pass enough. Well said. All right. Thank you, Scott. Thank Go you. enjoy. We'll see you later. All right. What's up, Shai? Why do we even give him a mic? Are, oh, baby. Are we live? Oh, I down. see the red light. Is the red light live? Oh. We want to turn the table and ask you a question. Oh, God. All these years yeah. of you not playing sports, why are you so, so sweaty and wet? <laughs> you know why? <laughs> really? See, I want to tell you a little story. Little story. See, there were two guys. No, it's not a muscle. There were two captains who thought they were funny, and they thought they were going to pull a, a good one on, on, on me. But you know what's funny? They screwed it up. <laughs> Okay. Not really, because no. somebody's all wet. No, really. no, 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 You're no. lucky that we are a little bit nice. Oh, there's not. There, you don't have a can nice we, bone in your body. Can we bring that we brought for him? Can we bring yeah. Oh, my God. Yeah. Are you going to put him hold on, on, hold on. I'm getting a onesie. Hold on, hold on. You're going to put me in a onesie? Is that what you're going to do? I just want to ask you a real question. Please, please. Did you see the Lubavitch to Lubavitch connection on the ice? That was a great, that was a great goal. That was a great goal. Shout out, Shout out. to 770 yes. <laughs> and all <laughs> the tunnel goals. <laughs> but they passed that right through the tunnel. That's great. <laughs> and we're, we're here live after the game. A great game between the, uh, for, for the captains. Final score was 7-5. 7-6. 7-6? 7-6? Nine something. No, no, no. <laughs> they stopped putting points on the scoreboard. Um, yes, and it was a great, it was a great time. Great time had by all. Um, and I guess we're going to wait for some of the uh, guys to come out. Probably won't. Okay. Uh, 